Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Taylor Christensen and Garrett Terrell. <laughs> I'm from Texas. I'm Tyler. <laughs> Channel. This is Garrett and Tay <laughs> and today we why are you shaking your head? What? I think I just looked to the right and then to the left and then to the right then to the left. <laughs> Today we're gonna be doing a first video first not our first video but our first video So we're gonna be sharing the first time we hung out <laughs> our first date our first kiss our first time <laughs> we said I love you. Maybe our first road trip, but you guys already know about that. Yes. I, I don't know. Okay, we'll just share <clears> some <throat> of those stories. Okay, so the first time we hung out was last year in May. Came home from school. She had invited me to go to Ocean Shores with her and her friends. And so I got home, I think on like a Saturday night. We had planned to go on Sunday and I woke up and I literally threw up like twice that morning. And I was like, crap, I have to hang out with her. So I took a hot shower and then I put like a cold washcloth over my head, took ibuprofen, Excedrin, everything you can think of. She came and picked me up and then we went to Ocean Shores with our friends, Tony and Shaylee. So at first, so that was the first time we were like leaving the house and we were supposed to come pick him I was supposed to come pick him up alone and we had never like we've known each other for years But we had never really hung out by ourselves So I yeah. don't know if it was gonna be awkward or not, but we had been talking nonstop for like a year So he texted me at first that he wasn't feeling well and that he might not come and I obviously like said the right thing And I was like, oh, it's fine if you're sick you can stay home But I didn't want him to stay home. I wanted him to come because obviously I wanted to hang out with him He ended up coming and I was really happy. I acted like I didn't care, but I cared. She did. I went and picked him up and uh, that was like our first hug. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of awkward because we just were like kind of nervous. I was nervous. I was, we, yeah, I was a little nervous. We were really comfortable talking to each other, but we had never hung out in person. So I was like, what if like we don't vibe in person? <laughs> I just thought, Don't vibe. I just thought it was going to be really awkward. So he was coming out of the garage when I got to his house and I was going to the front door because that's like the nice adult thing to do. And so I texted him that I was there and I was going to walk to the front door and then I heard the garage door open but I was like, what if that's his mom? Like I just didn't know who it was. So I heard the garage door and I was like, so I kind of peeked around the corner and then he was coming out and I was like, oh hi. And he was like, hi. And then we, we gave hugged. each other like a half hug and yeah. Then you owe the first gift. So me and my mother were driving home from Texas and we stopped in like this little gift shop in like, I think it was Arizona. New Mexico. New Mexico. There was a little necklace of a, her tattoo, her, uh, I don't even know what you call that thing. Bull skull? I think it was a little necklace with that pendant on the end. And so I was like, hmm, I should get this for her. So I got it and Gave it to her when we hung out. It's been hanging from my rear view mirror in my truck ever since that day. Our first date before we were actually dating. First date. You do. You, you, <laughs> you, you. Our first date before we were actually- I was gonna say you go or you do it. <laughs> I was like, you do. Our first date before we were no. dating, we went to uh, Red Robin and we like kind of liked each other but we hadn't really <laughs> talked about it yet why are you laughing this is just funny to think of it back then because this like, was like a year ago it was like literally a year ago we were interested but we were like best friends that didn't like each other but we did <laughs> and talked for like ever a long hours time. and like we were just so comfortable with each other and yeah that was like our first date per se i guess he paid for my food <clears throat> and then when i said bye is that when you knew i liked you yeah You just asked me a question and yeah. I answered. <laughs> I knew she liked me because when we went to walk out to like, I was gonna walk her to her truck and I like, we like walked to her truck and right as we got there, she like turned around and gave me this big hug. And that was like our first time. That sounds weird. <laughs> it was like our first like long hug. <laughs> but we just like, Hugged for like five well, seconds. Well, like, you know when you hug, seconds. when you just hug a friend that like, you know, really, It's just like... You're just like, it's just really quick. But we but hugged for like... Like ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> no, it just was, it was just a good hug. I guess he says that's when he knew I first liked him. Yeah. But I was leaving the next day to go on a week trip to Alabama with my family. And that's when I knew I liked him. The first time I realized I liked him, I guess, I guess this is a first video. Yeah. First time I realized I liked him was when I was on that trip, I actually missed him and I was like, wait, I don't miss people normally. <laughs> but I was excited to come home because I wanted to 
hang out with him. Yeah. All it took was Red Robin. I do love Red Robin. <laughs> <laughs> also, I know everyone's gonna ask what we're drinking. A lot of people don't have these, like where they're from. But these are Red Bull Italian sodas. Red people Bulls, say it's I'm just Italian. a can of Red Bull with flavor. This is blue raspberry. He has raspberry with cream. Cream. Uh, Our first kiss. You can share this. <laughs> Uh, okay. Gosh. <laughs> okay. Our first kiss was... I can't! I, you have to do it! No, I've done everything so far. <laughs> you have to do it. Okay, we went to a drive-in. <laughs> Gosh. And we took my truck, and we had blankets in the back and pillows in the back, and we were just... <laughs> anyway, um... We kissed. We were watching the movie, basically. It's first not- first kiss was at a drive-in movie theater. It was pretty cute. So we were at a, the drive-in and obviously it's like dark outside and the stars were like, if you want to get like cute and gross about it, there was <laughs> stars outside and like we were in the back with blankets and pillows and I don't know, you just kissed me. We just kissed. It wasn't awkward. Mm-mm. Which is good. Well, do you think it was awkward? No. Okay. Oh, first time we said I love you. She said it first. So we went to like a beach day and we took her dad's Jeep. Wait, and we... I want to share a part really quick. Okay. And then I want you to share. So we went to, back to Ocean Shores. So I wanted, I knew that we kind of were feeling the same way. We knew really early, like I knew I would, I mean, we're not even engaged yet, but I knew I would marry him before we were even dating just cause you, when you know, you know. We both kind of like felt the same way and very early in our relationship and I knew he was gonna say it soon. Maybe it wasn't nice of me, but I wanted to beat him to it cause I had a really cute way I wanted to do it. So I like planned for it like a, for a couple weeks before I even did it. But after a month of dating, <laughs> we went to go back to Ocean Shores cause that was like the first place we ever hung out. That's why we went back to Ocean Shores. So we had a Ocean Shores day. We took her dad's Jeep. So we went to the beach. <laughs> it was a beach day. <laughs> <laughs> Just farted. <laughs> I <was laughs> That's horrible. Oh my gosh. So we went to the beach. <laughs> <laughs> we went to the beach in her dad's Jeep and we kind of did it. <laughs> Why? <laughs> and it was super fun. We went on mopeds, we went mini golfing, we went. What are they called? Mopeds, Jeeps, ice cream. Ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> we had ice cream McDonald's. after ice cream and McDonald's after <laughs> gosh not dune buggies why am I keep thinking dune buggies mopeds we went on mopeds <laughs> oh my gosh I almost got a federal offense yeah so she was driving through like a pack of seagulls and they like flew away and we got a cool boomerang from it and then this like beach ranger flips on its lights and like comes behind us. <laughs> they pull us over on the beach and they were like, uh, yeah, you can't go through a pack of seagulls. It's like a felony. Didn't know that. We didn't know. <laughs> that was a... So don't do that. Yeah. We were so... like, and before she even pulled us over, we were drifting in the sand. Yeah. And then like, we didn't even go through the seagulls. We went next to the seagulls and they flew away. And she was like, I mean, she didn't give us a ticket or anything, but... No. She was kind of mean. <laughs> she Probably was like, these seagulls are protected by the state of Washington. If one of them dies, then you get charged like, I don't know, so much I was money. Like, this gets really expensive. It's a federal offense. I was like, for a seagull? I mean, I wasn't even gonna hit it. I wasn't even next to it. This was like but... I, this is my second time ever going to Ocean Shores. Meanwhile, this whole time I was nervous because like I knew he felt the same way, but I didn't really expect him to say it back. And I was about to tell him, and then I got pulled over for like a federal offense, and I was just really nervous, so that kind of added to everything. That's kind of funny. Right after that, we went and parked <coughs> in the sand. Then she gave me this little envelope, 30 reasons why she likes me. And so we went through all of them, it was super cute and everything, and then the very last page said she loved me. And I was like, I was reading it, reading it, all of it, and then... You love me? I was so nervous. Even though I knew he felt the same way, but I just was like... I didn't want to have to explain myself to him because it was like really early in our relationship. I yeah. never said I love you that quickly ever. But I don't know. I feel like if you love someone, you shouldn't like 
when wait you know, a certain amount of time. Like yeah. you, you need to tell the person. When you know, you know. A little correction. So in the bottom of the letter, you said the last reason was that I said I love you. But so at the very end, <clears throat> it wasn't like the thirtieth reason. But I wrote down thirty reasons. Like I like you because blah 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 blah. All these traits about him that I like. <laughs> the very bottom of the letter. I said, uh, for all these reasons, I know that I like you, and for these same reasons, I know that I love you. And then he was like, <gasps> and then I thought about recording it because it would be cool to watch <clears throat> later, but it was just too much no. to like even think about hiding a care. I just was like, I can't. Yeah, I didn't expect him to say it back, but he did. Mm -hmm. And um, our first trip we ever did together was bringing him down to school last fall. We drove from Washington to Texas. That, that was, was a fun. long time. She and was, I was sick. So she sick. was sick. Like feverish sick. Like I was so was cold bad. and I had to It was 85 bumps. degrees outside. She was freezing. He was being really sweet because I was so cold that he had to blast the heat and he was sweating because it was like 80 degrees outside. Dripping sweat in my car. But I was so cold. Dripping. So it was a fun trip, but also like it kind of sucked because I was really sick the whole time. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully that was a good video. You guys wanted it. A lot of you asked for it. Yeah, I don't know if we so. shared all the stories you wanted. I don't really know what else you would share. So I think that that's pretty much it. We're really boring people. We're really not interesting. So if you want to subscribe, you should. You can. <laughs> Follow us on Instagram. At Garrett underscore Terrell and at Taylor Christensen. Yep. Okay, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. We really, Bye! We really appreciate it. Bye!